Calvin Castein at the Amy Gallagher Memorial Field, beautiful downtown Rouse's Point. It's the fifth day of July 2011. This is Pee Wee Softball. It's uh, Altona and the Champlain Rouse's Point squad. This is Kendall Bush at the plate. Whoops, where are we here? There she is. On the pitching rubber is Brianna Forky. And battery mate is Miranda White. 87 degrees when I arrived here today, so that's kind of on the warm side. That's fouled. Sam Lajway, the coach over on the Altona side. So you know they're in good hands. Bill Forkey's calling the balls and strikes back there. As uh, Kendall Bush has struck out. Now Mara Ryan is the batter. Rick Garand and uh, and Mandy Dubuque are the uh, coaches for Champlain Rouses Point. Day after the 4th of July. That was a strike. A little high. Now, Tona will be uh, batting 12 batters. Get everybody in the lineup. Else Point will bat 10. Uh, so that's uh, another strikeout, I guess. And this is Emily Perrier. Perrier up. Strike. Good swing. That's what you like to see. Swinging at that ball. Uh, Ross, Champlain Rouse's Point has uh, 14 players, so they'll be substituting four players. That's fouled. All over the backstop. And I got I zoom, <laughs> I zoom moves fast in this camera. Still getting used to it. Still getting used to it. Oh, if I take my eyes off the viewfinder, I suddenly find myself zooming in. Whatever direction the camera happens to be pointing at the moment. Here's a pitch from Forky. It's foul ball. A little soft pop up to third is dropped. And she's going to be safe at first. So we got a base runner. And Juliana Gardner. She's going to be the Altona pitcher. The only positions I managed to get out of these guys is uh, pitchers. Uh, I started a couple minutes early, and of course, we were scrambling to write lineups in. Uh, moments before the start of the game and neither book that I saw had the positions written in and the grounder back to Forky over to first she's going to beat it out she beat it out Yep, a rainbow throw, and she beat it out. A close one. There's Grace Thune. Two on, two outs. Strike one, says Bill Forky. Right two. Strike three. So Altona will strand two. And we'll go to the bottom of the first with no score here on viewer supported hometown cable. First ball hitting. <laughs> um, Julio Turno. 
We were able to turn a little swing with the first offering and the catcher couldn't find it. Strike two. Bottom of the first inning. No score here. And Rouse is point at the Amy Gallagher Memorial Field. That's a foul ball. One and two. Looks like a 2 2 pitch. Pretty close, pretty close. Good footwork. Oh, for close on that one. Inside, that'll be ball four. No. No. 3 2. Hmm. Looks like I counted wrong. Wow, that sharply hit. And she'll be on it first. So, Laterno with a leadoff base hit. Oh, second baseman Lauren White at the plate. <coughs> oh, caught in the air. Yeah, Laterno gets back. Good play by Gardner. <coughs> now here's Brianna Forky. High towering fly. <laughs> Nobody wants to go after it. Too hot to get on a warm day. They'll score a run and uh, they're not haven't fielded it out there cleanly, so they'll send her. So Forky gets a four bagger. It's two nothing. And Brianna Guerin will step in. A little high. That's oh, ball four. Aaron's after Easton. Aaron's after Easton. Oh, Garen walks. There's Easton Francis. Named after a hockey stick. If her father was a baseball coach, she'd be a Louisville slugger, Francis. Good job. Hustle, Bree. Hustle, Bree. Hustle, Bree. Don't stop, Bree. Don't stop, Bree. And she is called safe at second. This is Aaron Sousa. Carissa's after Aaron. Miranda's after Carissa. Just one out, I think. Here's a strike. Get ready, Aaron. ready. Two one, ball three. This way, nice on, line on. shot to first. Oh! Foul ball. Contact. Good job, Aaron. Same thing. Foul ball. It landed fair and bounced over the line. That's where it was fielded, and it's in front of the bag. So. Strike three. Francis goes down looking, and Aaron Sousa will step in. Nope. Nope, that was Aaron Sousa. This is Carissa Gay. Carissa Gay. That was Aaron Sousa. What do we have? Two on, two outs, two in. We have the seventh batter of the inning. Looks like there might still be players arriving from Altona. Good job. A little quicker, that's okay. It's there, you're swinging. Randy, get ready. Good hit, Carissa. Head back to the mound. Over the first, through the mitt. Good hit, Carissa. I'll bring up Miranda White. Come on, Miranda, hustle, Miranda. Hustle, Miranda. Hustle, at the plate. They got her. So, good play there by the pitcher Gardner. Fired to the plate for the out. Two runs for Champlain Rouse's point. They lead it as we go to the top of the second here on viewer supported hometown cable. 
Didn't see anybody. I'll find out for you, though, All right. This is uh, Chloe Lobdell at the plate. Uh, Chella. 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 Sure on the last name. Well, we'll find out before all is said and done. It's Chella. Chella. All right, the late arrival is Chella. We'll get a last name for her before it's all is said and done. Chloe Lobdell at the plate. Second inning, two nothing Champlain Rouse's point. Bill Forky uh, <laughs> getting a workout behind the plate, catching the errant pitches. Ball fourth. Lobdell walks. Monica Charland. Looks like she's. Ready to hit that ball. Strike. <laughs> that was a foul ball. Ooh, close. I think we got a full count and a payoff. Chopped back to Forky. Lobs it over to first. One out. Here's Alexis Lafave. Tying run at the plate here in the top of the second. Foul back. Swing and a miss. That was strike three. So that's uh, two down, I guess. And Madison Brunel. Paging Madison Brunel. That's high. That was ball four. So Brunel walks. There's Bailey Labarge. Oh, late decision on the swing. <laughs> Sam uh, Lajway jokingly asking Bill Forkey if that was a check swing. <laughs> a little high. That uh, was ball four, so Labarge walks. All right, this is Taya Albert. Taya Albert up. Oh, close one. Called safe. A close one. 
Bags are full. There's Kayla Donor. Kayla Donor. Or Donner. Donner, I think. Kayla Donner. Tying runs at second base. Two outs. Bounces up. Hitter. But no hit batters at this game in this uh, level. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. Strike three. Uh, leaves the bags loaded. We're going to go to the bottom of the second. Still 2 nothing. Champlain Rouse's point leading. Aotona. If you've been waiting for Devin Kellogg to step to the plate. She's there. Strike one to start the bottom half of the second inning. Her team up two to nothing on this very pleasant uh, July 5th. Was ball four, so she walks. Morgan Woods at the plate. Strike one. One on. Strike one on a batter. Foul ball. Whoa, strike three. Look a good one. Now Julia Laterno step in. Top of the order up. Swings at the first offering. Strike one. Two pitch. Big three. Uh, he's swinging the bat. Now, Lauren White will be at the plate. To the right side. Throw the first, and she's out. And will take us to the third inning. Our score is 2 0 Champlain Rouse's point, otherwise known as Kavanaugh Realty, leading Altona, who have a whole bunch of people on the back of their shirts. We're going to go to the third inning. Alright, we are. This is Chella Hill. We're in the. Uh, Sixth inning, excuse me, third inning. Third inning, top of the third. Two nothing to score. Three and two. Full count. Pitch to Hill is fouled off. Good cut there. Strike called. Now we're going to go to top of the order. Kendall Bush at the plate. Look at the world. Look at 
swing, Kendall. Good swing, Kendall. Strike. One and two the count. Full count. I ball four. So Bush will go to first. Hustlin to first. And Mara Ryan will step in. Yeah, Tona at the plate. Strike. It's three and one, according to Bill Forky. It's a strike. Three two, full count. One on, one out here in the third. Two nothing. Altona trailing. That's ball. Four. Oh, Ryan walks. She'll hustle the first. And Emily Perrier will step in. Uh, lefty hitter. High fly ball. Caught at short. Oh, would have been two. Would have been two. So there's two down, a good, good effort there by the shortstop. And I bring up Juliana Gardner. Strike one. Swings at a high one. Time. Oh, we got a runner. I'm gonna get a, I'm gonna get a catcher. Uh, yeah, catcher starting to get ready. Are you getting their catching gear on or what? Uh, it was ball four, so Gardner goes to first. Grace Thune steps in. Base is full. Swing. swing and a miss. Good cut. Like two, good pitch. Sam didn't like it. Two and two, the count. Like three. Good pitch to swing at, but she decided not to. Remains 2 nothing. We're going to the bottom half of the third here on Viewer Supported Hometown Cable. Strike one to Brianna Forky as we start the. Start the what are we starting? We're starting the uh, bottom of the third. 2 nothing score. Relax, wait for it, Brianna. Relax and wait for it. Hi, pop up. <laughs> Where'd that ball go? <laughs> I'm always amazed when the catcher can find them. <laughs> two two pitch. 
High fly ball. It's dropped. Good try. Good try. Tracked it down. That was a high sky high pop up. So Forky reaches. Now uh, Brianna Garand will step in. Strike one. Back back and ready, okay? There you go. There, like. Come on, come on, Bree. Can't be Tim, you gotta swing. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, first and second. Two Brianna's on. East and Francis at the plate. Hustle, hustle, hustle. Foul ball, strike one. Good hustle. East, remember, shoulders and knees, shoulders and knees. Strike two. Good cut right there. Good cut right there. Ooh, close. Come on, close. Strike three. Oh, Francis goes down a swinging. And he'll bring up Aaron Sousa. There she is. And a pitch. Oh, hustle, hustle. Run right by the base. Run right by the base. Hustle. Oh, throw goes high. Everybody hold up. Out of play. Now we have Carissa Gay batting. Uh, the second and third. Round number three has crossed the plate. There's the ball hit to first. Run will score. And we got Miranda White fouling off the first pitch. Strike one. Here we go, Miranda. Swing hard and run fast, okay? Four nothing to score. Strike two. He's up there swinging. Yeah, foul ball. Getting her licks in. Come now, Miranda. Come on, Miranda. Hustle, Miranda. Hustle, to the Hustle, left Miranda. side, he's going to beat it out. Right Infield hit for Miranda White. Devin's up. Uh, we got Devin Kellogg Devin, swinging Devin, at the first Devin, offering. Run, Devin, run, Devin. And he'll be right. place it unassisted at the plate to add the first on the bag. What they score? Three, maybe? Two or three? Two or three? I think they scored three, so I think it is five nothing. We'll check that and go to the fourth inning here on Viewer Supported Hometown Cable. Morgan. No. No, wrong team. <laughs> Chloe Lobdell. Chloe Lobdell is at the plate. We're in the top of the fourth inning. Five nothing. Champlain Rouse's point leads. I missed a strike right there. Trying to clean off my viewfinder. I got dirtied between innings as a couple of young brats came over and uh, looked through my viewfinder. Kids, with their dirty fingers. It's a hard hit ball. And, and, and out at first. Good play, good play. 
Well hit ball and a good play. Everybody did good in that one. Love to lined it on the ground, a ground hard grounder, and here is uh, Monica Charland. Charlotte hits it back to Forky, throws the first, and we have two down. And number 10 is retired. <laughs> and are they coming out of the starting gate over there? <laughs> Whatever happened to being on deck. Alexis Lefebvre. Top of the fourth. Strike called. I think it's a 2-1 count or one out. 3-1. Strike two. Back to, oops, she's going to beat it, she's going to beat it, and um, she is on, oh, that's uh, Lefebvre reaching, Madison Brunel steps up, it's a strike at the navel, that's known as a navel strike, hi, Strike two. Late decision to swing. She liked it, but missed it. So we're going to go to the bottom of the fourth. It's five to nothing. This is Aislinn McDonough. Strike one. We're in the bottom half of the fourth. Five nothing. Champlain Rouse's point leading Altona. Pitch from Gardner is strike two. We have a, some subs that might not get up there. If Champlain Rouse's point might only bat to uh, uh, strike three. Uh, one more inning. Julia Laterno. So we'll see get a, a lot of batters this inning. There are several who might not see the See the plate. There's a strike. Uh, Taylor LaBombard. Uh, Caitlin Southwick. Cassidy Nixon. Oh, that's hard hit. <laughs> She's going to be safe. going to be safe. All right. They're calling her Bailey's. That'd be Bailey LaBombard there. Hitting the ball. Getting the ball right on the ankle there. <laughs> Keeping it in, in the infield. Here's uh, Lauren White. So let's see, you got Cassidy Nixon, um, Ashley Gregware. They might not see an at bat unless we can get a little rally of sorts going here. Lauren White hits it to Labarge, and White will reach. And we have first and second. And uh, we have Brianna Forky. Swings at a high offering, hits it a high. Whoa! Surprise, surprise. <laughs> All right, they didn't think she was going to catch that one. <laughs> oh, she'd, oh, she'd say who she is. <laughs> All right, whoever she is, heck of a catch. Heck of a catch, double play. So it took the potential rally away from Champlain Rouse's point. We've got, uh, we're going to see Taylor LaBombard in this fifth, but we may not see Southwick, Nixon, or Gregware. Stick with us. We will find out if they will get a chance to bat. We're going to the top half of the fifth right now. Oh, 
We got Bailey LaBarge taking a strike to start the top half of the fifth. Her team down by a five nothing margin. Nothing that a six run rally wouldn't cure. Forky delivers. Strike two. And Lodgeway's in. You ready there, sweetheart? Whoa. Strike three, good cut. Nice cut there by LaBarge. That's one down. And Taya Albert will step in. Or Taya, Taya, I think. Taya. Taya Albert. She's got the Ganyanka golf course in the back of her shirt. And the pitch. Hard hit the short. She's going to reach, I think. I think, I think she is. Don't slow down. She's coasting in there. She's got to run through that. Whoop, she's going to go to second. <laughs> well, that wasn't out of play. Kayla Donner to play. Huh? Yeah, right. yeah, over, yeah. Okay. Gee, I heard second base. My bad. Swing and a miss. Good cut. The three. That's three. So Donner is out, and Chella Hill will step in. Strike one. She's gonna hit that ball. Ball. Oh, knocked down by four keys. Gonna fire to first and be first and second. Kendall Bush, the batter. I think we're going to get a sub for the catcher. The catcher can start. She can start warming up. Bush is now. Uh, I mean, Hill is now the catcher. Bush was, I think, before. First and second, two down. Strike one. <laughs> the little girl over there by the. Uh, Tall bushes there. It's like a huge forest to somebody that size. Like two. Strike three. So the strand two, we're going to go to the bottom of the fifth. Let's see how many Ralph Pointers and Champlainers will get to swing that bat. And it's still 5 nothing after four and a half. Emily Perrier is pitching for... Altona. Uh, we look at everybody in the stands. I think over the Altona side. I think we did. Then we got Brianna Garen. Look out! There goes her no hitter. And Garen starts it off with a shot up the middle. To lead off the bottom of the fifth. 
Now we got uh, Brianna Guerin. That was, no, that was Guerin. This is Easton Francis. Easton Francis. Garen is on it first. Easton Francis on the plate uh, at the plate. Taylor Lombard on deck. Two and one. Foul ball. Yanked foul. Foul ball. Foul tip. Foul tip. Another foul ball. Strike three. Oh. Francis goes down swinging. Taylor and Caitlin. And Taylor at Labumbar to step in. One out. And uh, Caitlin Southwick on deck. This is Labumbar. Okay. Five one. Five one. They got one? Okay. Five one. Apparently Altona scored one. I haven't been giving him credit for it. Five one is the score. That's ball four. The bombard. Goes to first. So it's first and second. And there's Caitlin Southwick. I have one out. Hit the short, nice stop, throw to third, and everybody's going to be safe. And the sun's coming out here. Looks nice out here when the sun shines. Huh? Nice bright picture here. That loads the bases, so Southwick is on. Now Cassidy Nixon and Ashley Gregware on deck. So unless, uh, unless Nixon hits into a double play, and we've had uh, at least one of those today. Uh, and Gregoire will get the bat, Ashley, which is always good. Strike. Green light on a three, you know, that's three and one. It's a well hit ball, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> no double play. Could have been. Put the brakes on. Well hit ball. A well hit ball there by uh, Nixon. Now we get to see Ashley Gregoire. So everybody gets the bat. That's always good. Always go home feeling very bad. I forget about it after I get home, but feeling very bad when everybody doesn't get the bat. Gregoire hits it. Two Perrier. Perrier heads up play. Somebody's been telling her what to do. We know it isn't Sam Lajway, so it must be Stephen and Shelley. We're gonna or maybe even Ken and Judy. Or maybe somebody on the LaPointe side, huh? We're gonna go to the sixth inning. It's five nothing Champlain Rouse's point leading five one. Five one. Five one correcting that. Leading Altona. Okay, what do we got here? We got uh, Mara Ryan at the plate. We got the. Uh, we're gonna catch in here. Uh, her Uncle Tim's teaching her how. Tim, of course, a catcher. Uncle Tim McDonough, a catcher at Dartmouth, caught. Uh, Jim Beatty, who was a star pitcher and went on to play Major League Baseball and for a while was general manager up at uh, Montreal for the Expos. Uh, we had the pleasure of going up to Olympic Stadium and bringing Tim along and they 
with them uh, greeting each other for the first time in many years. But the swallows are out there. Got a bunch of them floating around up in the sky. Five on the score here in the top of the sixth. So what a quick, good cut, good cut there, Lamara Ryan. Even Sam Lajway like that. Here's Emily Perrier. A relief pitcher. Who's, uh, who's her advertising shirt here? Oh, the fave uh, trucking or something. Well hit. The short, and she's going to reach a base hit for Emily Perrier. Uh, Juliana Gardner. One on, one out. So, top of the sixth in a six inning ball game. Good cut. That's a ball. Ball four. So Gardner draws a base on balls. The first and second. Grace Thune is up. With the strike. One out. Let's strike three, so that's two down. And Chloe Lobdell will step in. Last hope for Altona, trailing 5-1. Forky doing a little plate cleaning here. Ball four. Lobdell will make her way to first. It's going to load the bases full of Altonians. And up the score is five to one. It'll. Uh, It'll uh, put the tying run at the plate. Monica Sherland. Strike two. And the pitch from Forky. A little high. Full count. Full count. Bags full. Something's going to happen here. Two outs. Ball four. That'll walk in a run. It'll be 5 2. Alexis Lefebvre now. Strike one. Tying run is. On base. She hits it. Drop. 
And another run scores at 5-3. 5-3. And the tying run is moved to second base. Go ahead run is on at first. Madison Brunel, the batter. Ball one. Ball two. Three and oh. Ball four. That'll make it, I believe, five four. And Bailey Labarge becomes their last hope for Altona. A little high. 2 0. 2 0. Looks like the tying run is about to be walked in. And there's a strike. Three and one. Suddenly, Labarge has to be a hitter. Strike two. Good, good swing. Full count. The tension, the tension. Tying run at third base. Bags full. Strike three. Nice pitch. Nice pitch from Forky to end it. So it's a 5-4 to four victory for the home team. They defeat Altona with a tying run at third. Go ahead, run at second, and insurance run at first. So that's the way it was. July 5th, 2011. You've been watching viewer-supported local television, hometown cable. Win, lose, a draw, TV worthy of your support, hometown cable. If you want to see this programming continue, more and more of you are going to have to step up and do your part to support local, local television. The only support we get is when somebody just like you decides to get off their wallet and send us a check. Thanks for those of you who do. 